Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm doing okay. Thank you. How are you today? Fine. Very fine. Good. Thank you. Nice. Okay, everybody, welcome back. Welcome to your last class. Before anything, I want to congratulate you guys for um, being brave and attending classes all these um, this past four weeks. So congratulations. Um, let me ask you, what part of the platform are you doing right now? I already finished it. Good, nice. Okay, okay, someone else said me too. That's good. Is somebody still doing unit four or unit three? Like Marvin, what part of the platform are you in? Marvin, can you hear me? Maybe not. Benjamin, can you hear me? Hi, teacher. Yeah, what I can part hear of, you. Teacher. What part of the platform are you doing right now? Uh, number five. Good. Today I am starting this part. Okay, good, good. Uh, Edward, what part of the platform are you doing? I'm finished, teacher, the platform. Good, good. Uh, Juan Jose? I am finished, teacher, the platform. Good. Gabby? I'm finished, too. Good. Clara? I'm finished, teacher. Nice. Annie? I finished the church. Good. Rebecca, she was the first one to say she finished. Noeli? <coughs> Only uh, the Unify. Okay, finished. good. And Claudia, what part of the platform are you doing? I'm finished. Good, very good. That's the attitude. All right, so congratulations once again. Let's begin. Can someone tell me today's date? July what is today's date? Uh huh. 23rd. July 23rd. 2020. 2020. Very good. So if today is the 23rd, what was yesterday? 22nd. The 22nd. How do you say anteayer in English? Does anybody know? How do you say anteayer in English? No, teacher. It's... The day before yesterday. That is correct. The day before yesterday. So the translation <laughs> is, in this case, is literal. The day before yesterday. So the same way you say anteayer, how will you say pasado mañana? The day after tomorrow. Very good, the day after tomorrow. So if today is the 23rd, yesterday was 22nd. What was the day before yesterday? What was the date? Can you think about that question? Exactly. What is tomorrow? What is tomorrow's date? Tomorrow 20, 24th. 24th. And what is the day after tomorrow? 25th. After 24th, we have? 25th. 25th. Very good. All right. So let's talk about yesterday. Do you remember the activities we did yesterday? Yes, teacher, I remember. Okay. What were uh, the topics we covered? The uh, Models. Models, yes. Uh, according to yesterday's session, what is the main function of uh, of models, what is their, what do they do to the verb? Mm. Mm. 
I think it, it, uh -huh. you can express modality, ability, possibility, or near or, or other condition. Good, good. That is exactly um, what the function is. The, you know, probability, when something is mandatory, suggestion. So they give a specific function to the, to the verb. So yesterday I wrote this example, something like, um, uh, where is this? Uh, you can dance. What is the meaning of it in that sentence? Man, you can dance. What is the message? Mm -hmm. If you have the ability to dance. Good, you have the ability to dance. Your legs move really well. So imagine you go to a party and you're going like this and someone tells you, man, you should dance. What is the meaning in that sentence? Uh-huh. It's a suggestion. It's a suggestion, exactly. Look, I see that you're moving your body and everything. Go ask somebody, you should dance. And then, you say, look, you must dance. It's your birthday. What is the message in that sentence? It's our obligation, teacher. Exactly. Or, or yeah. needed something. Okay, so you can dance. That's an ability. You should dance. That's an advice. And you must dance is something mandatory. So I'm using the same verb, dance. But the, but the model that I'm using gives an, a specific meaning to the main verb. So we mentioned yesterday that um, we have models that they have um, single function and some of them they have um, double function. Now, what do you understand by single function? What is single function, function to you? Do you see the screen? Do you see the image that I'm sharing now? Yes. Yes, okay. teacher. What, what, this is a list of models. Could is for, is the past tense of can, might is a possibility, should is suggestion, will is for future. So all of them, they have a particular uh, function on the verb that you're using. <coughs> So, can you see that image? Yes, yes. Okay, what is, what is the name of that uh, image? Uh-huh, a volunteer to read? Medijan. Okay, please. Single concept models. Mm -hmm. And this list say, will, if, should, up to had better. All right. So for the single concept, thank you, Edward. You have will, might, should, ought to, and had better. That means that these five right here, they only have one function. What is the function of will? Probably. Will? Which tense do you use will for? Talk about the future. Future. What is might? <clears throat> what is might? A possibility. Possibility. Should? Yes. Uh -huh. Ought to? Advice. Yeah, ought to is to give advice, to give suggestions, but it's more formal than should. And then we have had better. What is the meaning of had better? So if I tell you, look, if you want to be part of the next level, you better finish the platform. What is the meaning of, of, of better in that case? Exactly. So it's a warning. It's a warning. So I said, if you want to be part of the next level, you better finish the platform. So it is necessary that you finish. Now, double concept, 
the, 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 the concepts that we're using here are little. What are the two functions of May? Who remembers the two functions of May? May I speak with you? May I go outside? What am I doing there? A possibility in a, in a future. You, what, what is it for, Edward? And a possibility in the future, it's possible. Okay, uh, it's a possibility, right? But in if I future. said, Edward, can, may I speak with you after class? What am it's I asking? Sure. Yes? It's a formal request. Exactly. We use may, like Edward says, it's a possibility. And your friend just said, it's, it's for to make request. May I speak with you? May I go outside? May I answer the phone? It's a request, very good. Now, what are the two functions of must? You must take your medicine. You must use only English in class. What does that tell you? It's an obligation, very good. Okay, what is the other function of must? The other function of must? So your your best friend wins the lottery and then you say uh, he must be happy or she must be happy. What does that tell you? I need it. Or need something. One more time. Need something, for example, you, you need something or... Okay, but if I say my best friend won the lottery, he must be happy. It, it's similar to more. Okay. No? Someone else? El debe estar feliz. El debe tener planes. Ella debe estar desesperada. What does that tell you? Something is true. Exactly. We use must as an assumption when we speak, when we think that something is true. Very good. So once again, must has double function. Something that is mandatory or when we think that something is true. What about would? What are the two functions of would? Um, I you, ask a question, you ask a question for his very, very, very education. Okay, it's, it's, okay. What else? So if I tell you, look, I would, I would help you, but I don't have the material with me. I would help you, but I don't have the material with me. Te ayudaría, pero no tengo el material conmigo. What am I saying there? I would help you. That means that the, the, the situation is hypothetical. Te ayudaría, pero no del material. Lo va a ayudar? No. So it's hypothetical. And what is the other function of wood? The other function of wood? Somebody? What if I tell you, when I was a teenager, I would live in California. When I was a teenager, I would live in California. What is the meaning of that sentence? When I was a kid, I would live near downtown San Salvador. What does that tell you? Is the platform to use to? Very good. We use would to talk about past events. We also mentioned that show is for future mandatory. Could is for abilities in the past tense of can. And can expresses uh, abilities that you can do. Any questions so far? Any questions before you start doing the talking? No, teacher. Okay, so I'm going to assign you to work in pairs. I will have is here. 
let me give me a second give me a second give me a second right here So, add room, open all rooms. But we can do, teacher. Right. Uh, I will show you now the questions you guys will discuss. One of your favorite places uh, in your life, I think. It is one of my favorite places. Let me see, where is this, where is this, where is this? Eight to nine. You can copy the questions from, uh, from here if you wish. And let me, there. Did you guys receive the image in the WhatsApp chat? I didn't receive the WhatsApp chat teacher. Can you put in the chat for Zoom? Um, okay, hold on. Da, 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 da. I don't know, the, the internet is very slow. Teacher, I have a problem with my internet. What is it? I have a problem with internet. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't know what uh, I had a class from six to seven thirty and while I was using Zoom, uh there was a buzz in, in the there was a, like a, a noise interfering. Yeah. Let me It's very strange. Who said that doesn't have access to uh, to the WhatsApp chat? Oh, excuse me. Who 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 mentioned that? Ah, number room number two. Oh, Claudia. Oh yeah, Claudia. Claudia Rivas, you don't you didn't receive the the. Mm -hmm. The image. Okay, yes. hold on. Let me check but this here. I don't know if I am in the room. Okay, let me see if I find you. What is what is your telephone number? Your first four numbers, Claudia. Can you hear me, Claudia? But I didn't receive two, teacher. My phone number is... Hmm. Which one is it? Eight. Seven, eight? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. 86. 86. 27. Uh-huh. Six, six. Two, six. Yeah. Six, okay. Six. 78, 86, 27, 26. Let's see. Six, six. Let's see. Where is your number? Hmm. Are you in the chat? <laughs> Claudia, are you, Claudia are, you, are you in the chat? Hi. Are you in the WhatsApp chat? Mm, yes. Huh, something. I, I have the, the, the image. 
So, did you receive the image? Yes, teacher. Okay, but, but I'm still wondering why not everybody is connected to their groups. Internet is very slow. Let me check on something. Mm -hmm. Pull, verdad? Uh -huh. sí, pull. For me, it's better in a pool. Yeah. But the, maybe the, the, um, the vibes are very good for you relax. Yeah, I, I, I like um, uh, the most I like to do in the beach is um, swing in the, in the sea, uh, swing mm -hmm. in the pool and take a drink. <laughs> Take a yes. drink, see, um, see the see the twilight too. Yeah. Uh huh. Ver el atardecer, and <laughs> I like to make. No sé cómo se dice fogata. Uh, oh. Wood fire. Wood fire. Yes. Oh, nice. No sabía. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Good. ¿Cómo? Full fire. Wood, 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 like madera. Ah, uh, mm -hmm. wood. Wood fire. Wood fire. Ajá, esa okay. es fogata. Ajá. Sí, siempre, las veces que fui, uh, we do a uh, wood fire. Ya. Yeah. <laughs> And that was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yes. In the, mid, in the midnight. At midnight. At midnight. Ah, oh, okay. Okay, number three is... Uh -huh. Yeah, <laughs> when I go to the beach, I like to to walk on the arena. <laughs> of the, uh, con qué gente Depends. vaya, supongo. Oh, okay, the... for me, the two places are... That enjoy the the beach. Maybe are good. Are good job. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. And you, Marvin. Okay. What number? Sunday. One. Number one. Sentence. Number one. Uh, what's the spring to me yeah. when hard the world beach? Uh, for me, is frankly, no sé qué más. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Do you like comments? Uh, Okay. okay. Another question. What do you like to do at the beach? At the beach. Uh, for me, okay. I like when I go to the beach. I I like to prepare. Uh, I don't know how do you say carne asada, but with my family, I prepare a lot of uh, food for. For all. Okay. And, yeah. you, and you, Claudia? In my case, like to do? I like to play. I have play the volleyball. I like to play volleyball with my family or my, or my friends. Okay. And I like. <laughs> it's, it's a scare when you see many people in the beach when i see the pictures mm -hmm. i i i know i don't know it's crazy it's, it's terrible <laughs> yeah i can imagine take i don't know it's card say take a shower <laughs> take a shower uh, between every, many things uh you know 
Hate to say on the pools. Yeah. Oh. Well, I the think that we park. need <laughs> we need a private pool. <laughs> uh huh. In our house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I poor. Me too. <laughs> We only we only have an option on the pillar. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> oh the oh the pool uh the the pool like uh kids. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's a plastic plastic pool. <laughs> yeah. Or the river. <laughs> Con la manguerita, sí. Ah, qué o, o te vas para el río. Ah, no. oh, también. Ahí el agua corre. Ah, está la laguna también. ¿Qué, ¿Qué nos gusta más? Estar en playa. Oh, sí. Ah, um, mountain. Ah, uh -huh. Yo también. For for me, in the case, it's the bear mountain. Why? Uh, in the mountain, it's very cold. Yeah. And the, and the beach, many sun. <laughs> uh, maybe in the mountain, you, you can see uh, many animals, many trees, and other things we can see in the morning for, for me for me it's in the, the mountain uh, me too uh, is is better uh, the cool the cool <laughs> uh, in my case i don't know <laughs> i like to, i like to <laughs> the beach and mountain uh, Montai, I can, I can go, I can see the the animals, different animals. Uh, in the, I don't know, that that do are are good for me. <laughs> and question four, is a beach holiday the best kind of holiday? So what is the answer? Number four. Uh -huh. It's a beach holiday, the best kind of holiday. Question number four says, is a beach holiday the best kind of holiday? So is it the best holiday you can have? Is it like the best kind? What is your opinion? I don't, I am not this type of friends that with you can go to the beach or you go out. But I think that other people, it's better to go with friends. No, uh -huh. it's just, but in my case, the times I have gone to the beach, I went with my friends because I have some friends who live in Puerto Libertad. Really? So I went to their house and then we went to the beach together. Wow. For that reason, I can, I, I could see the, el atardecer. Oh. The sunset. The sunset. Okay. So for that reason, I, I, I could see. It's really good. Hello, hello. On the beach. Maybe, yes, that's it, you like the beach. Maybe it's a good vacation. 
but mm. I don't like pass very kind in the beach. Maybe one day or two days, no, no more time. <laughs> Um, sí, I would prefer sí. the other place, but for 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 vacation or for holiday. Where place the camera? But is beach it's too? too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, Maybe visit yeah, the yeah. other country. <laughs> oh, Guatemala is beautiful country. Yeah. In, for holiday is very number six second. We we are discussing the number five. Uh, but maybe I I do the other question to you. Okay. Yes, I like the beach. And what do you like to do when you go to the beach? Um, eat a cocktail, eat fish. Um, eat a yeah, I, 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 uh, I will say that este iba a decir eso. Um, mm -hmm. in Europe, um, in Eurocam temp, no sé cómo se dice temporada. En season. 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 Yes, yes. In season, I don't want to live here. <laughs> there. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, and so, just for a couple months or yeah. four months, <laughs> yeah. uh, I would like live here, there. Okay. Um, number 10. When, or no, nine. Nine, nine. when <laughs> yeah. was the last time you went to the beach? Oh, yes, yes. Uh, yeah, lo dije. <laughs> sí, yeah. Okay. The 10. What kind of things can people do on the beach? Oh. Mm. Uh, you can, you can, you can do a uh, wood, a uh, wood fight. No fogata. Um, you can do um, soccer beach. Yeah. Beach soccer. soccer beach. Beach soccer. Beach soccer. Okay. Um, you can do volleyball. Yeah. And you can do uh, sans castle. <laughs> and my, other in my people case, like to to surfing too. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, okay, surfing. Okay. Um, what? Okay. What? No. <laughs> a lot of time. <laughs> a lot of, lot of time. I can I don't remember how is the beach, how is the water, <laughs> how is the ocean. <laughs> That's so much. I forget. <laughs> but you can see a picture. Yeah. <laughs> But I don't know how feel. But it's the same. Okay. <laughs> but it's the same. Or not? Hello? But it's the same, the girlfriend or the wife? Or not? <laughs> <laughs> it's more interesting with, with her friend. The sunset. 
the stones that, that imagine that it would be amazing. I don't know. I don't know. If you you like it? This something is very ugly for me. <laughs> you don't like the sunset, Edward? I don't like it. Never, teacher. It's really ugly. What about the, the sunrise? Same. Oh my goodness! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, Eduardo, you are the first person. Uh, don't like it, the beach. I never heard. <laughs> Yes, and don't like the sun <laughs> someday. <laughs> for me, it, for me, it's very, it's very rarely that the people prefer to go to the beach or, or another place. It's prefer yeah. a mountain or or lake or go to a movie theater. It's better. <laughs> the, the okay, it's your opinion. <laughs> okay, it's very uh, hot. And me, she told me that many uh, she have the opportunity with many men <laughs> that offer her all, all, see cars, money, uh, <laughs> a beautiful life, a big yeah. life. Uh, he told me that, uh, que, no sé cómo se, cómo se dice, ella tuvo. She has. She has. She has. Uh, she have a, a classmate that was rich, and and he offered her uh, the marriage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she is a very lucky person. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, but uh, when she she was there for the studies. Oh, and yeah. she she was very very uh, no sé cómo se dice humilde humble mm. humble humble uh, yes h u m b l e humble humble yes okay um she she was very humble and always she always preferred the studies and well and come back to to the country Oh yeah. Uh -huh. And who are you talking about, Benjamin? Who is uh, this person? Uh, uh old friend mine. Okay. Uh huh. A girl. <laughs> All right. Uh, she was she was in Germany and in two um two thousand ten, two thousand ten. Yeah. Yeah. And he um. Told me se puede utilizar para contar. Yeah, she told me. Yeah, she told she told me how she experienced in Germany, and I, I am, um, I am telling to Clara. Yeah, Clara, that man, she have she have the opportunity the the meeting many men for the color of her skin. What the color girl. was was her skin? Brunette. Rigueña. Okay. Brunette. Brunette. Okay. Brunette. And the German men love love the woman's brunettes. Okay. Brunette woman's. Good. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. Beach. The next time you were. Wow. Right away. <laughs> it's a possibility. I think probably at the beach, but in Atacualpa. <laughs> it's the most close. <laughs> it's the closer for us. The closest. The closest? Yeah, the closest. Okay, the closest. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> Are delicious food in this place? Oh, yeah. Many. Uh, many food. <laughs> oh, all Thai food. <laughs> yeah. I was sitting eating in the 10, 10 p.m. 
go to the disco. How do you say disco? Disco. Disco. Yeah, it's the same word. Okay. Right. Okay, so I think it's time to go back to the main session. All right, let's, let's begin with the most common question. When was the last time you were at the beach? When was the last time you went to the beach? In my case, I went to the beach in May of this year. May, oh. For the Mother's Day, yes. Oh, okay. So you broke the quarantine? Yes. Uh -huh. Okay, someone else wants to share? Oh, no, teacher, no, no, no había un. <laughs> oh, it was, it was after, yeah, it's right, you're mm -hmm. right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, somebody else wants to mention when was the last time you went to the beach? The last year, teacher. Last year, okay. I went to the beach. When? I went to the beach uh, two years ago. Two years ago? Okay. Yeah. Where do you live I right now, Juan? In Metaman. Oh, right, right. Yeah, that is a little bit far uh, no. to go to the beach. Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, what do you, what is your favorite activity when you go to the beach? Anybody? Um, to me, teacher. Uh huh. When uh, when I was in the beach, um, we uh, my favorite uh, thing was made uh, wood fire. And, okay. And midnight. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So when you go, when you guys go to the beach, you go to sleep late. Or do you go to bed early? Uh, to me, late, teacher. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Do you guys prefer the beach or the mountain? Mountain, teacher. Mountain. Okay. Do you think holidays are the best when you go to the beach? Or do you have other options? Other options, teacher. Other options? Okay. What dangers can you find at the beach? Clara, Noeli, Annie? Uh, what dangers can I, you find? I, uh huh. Uh, how, how we call uh, the uh, Erizo de Mar? Which one is that? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> no, but Erizo, Erizo de Mar. Erizo de Mar. I yes, it's una pelotita, it's una pelotita. It's, it's a ball with the spikes, and he and they and that have poison. Really? Because if yeah. you want to say erizo, the regular one, you say porcupine, but I I have never heard about erizo de mar. I I didn't know yeah. they existed. Mm, uh, I I know that I know uh, for. That name. <laughs> okay. So we can, yeah. I guess we can say uh, an ocean porcupine or a beach porcupine. Yeah, I think. Okay. <laughs> okay. Other dangers? Someone else? Gabby, Noeli? Maybe, uh, teacher. Uh, uh -huh, high Saira. tide. What is it? High tide. High, uh -huh, high tide. Yeah, that is dangerous. Even if you're a good swimmer, you have to be careful with the waves. Yes. Right, yes. Other dangers, Clara, Marvin, Gabby. No dangers when you go to the beach. No. Okay. So who is the best person to go to the beach with? 
Is your family, friends, boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife? Family teacher. Family. Okay. <coughs> so uh, does anybody think that it's better to go with friends than with family? Uh huh. It's a question. I think it's better both family and friends. Mix them. Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's a good plan. You know, like bring family and bring friends too. Okay. Now, what beach would you like to visit and why? If you could visit a beach in the world, which one would you visit? Uh, maybe for me, I so I'd be like to reach uh, uh, Cancun, teacher. Cancun. Yes, because it's amazing. Okay, good. Somebody says Roatán. Who says Roatán? Yes, on the left. Okay. Um, to me, teacher. Uh huh. Uh, my favorite beach is Santorini in Greece. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Now, if we talk about El Salvador, what is the best beach that we have? The pork. <laughs> <laughs> no, el, to, el tunco. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, why do you think El Tunco is the best one, Benjamin? Uh, be because have a uh, great waves, have a uh, great uh, restaurant, nightlife, um, nightlife, right, and have a uh, uh, good hotels. Okay. Um, and that's it. All right. I was I was there and it's a great place. Okay, good. Anybody else has a different opinion and thinks that uh, there are other beaches that are better than El Tunco? Or everybody agrees on El Tunco? You're quiet today. Why are you quiet? I prefer the um, La Costa del Sol. Okay. La Costa del Sol is better. Yeah. Okay. What about El Espino? Do you guys like El Espino? I yes. Never visited. No? Okay. It's 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 pretty nice because you know there are no waves. It's like it's flat. So you can walk um, in the ocean and and it won't be easy to wow. get over or, or you don't have any convenience with waves okay and uh, what kind of things can people do at the beach what are the traditional things to do at the beach okay play volleyball uh-huh Surfing. Surfing, swimming. Uh huh. Play with the sand. Play with the sand, exactly. Eat seafood. What is it? Eat seafood. Yeah, seafood is so good. Cocktails, fish. I'll prepare a barbecue, teacher. Yeah, barbecues. I love barbecues too. <laughs> yeah. Any other activity that you might do at the beach? Teacher, how do you say um, bronceado? Tan. T-A-N. Let me write it in the chat. Tan. So you go to the beach and you tan your skin. Do you see the chat? Okay. Yeah, you tan the beach. In my case, when I go to the beach, I never tan. I just get red, very red. <laughs> More than now, because I'm usually pink, but when I go to the beach, I turn red, really red. Okay, any other questions or comments about going to the beach? You can play soccer beach. Yeah, yeah, you can play soccer at the beach, right. 
Shoes or no shoes? No shoes. It's no better. shoes. All right. Okay. Yeah. Anything else before we change our last activity? We only have like 10 more minutes. Any questions or comments? No? Nothing. Okay, so let's go here. Our last practice. So let's do the first one. I love my neighborhood. It's very what? Safe. 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 All right. What about number two? I live on a very busy street. It can get a little bit. Noisy. 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 Okay. Number three. It's blank to have parking space near my apartment. Convenient. convenient. Oh, convenient. Okay, convenient. convenient. Number four. Our house is modern and very bright. It has... Huge. 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 What's the meaning of huge? Amplio. Yeah, very big. Yeah. Very big. Exactly. Okay, let me check this here. Mm. Any questions or any comments so far? No. Teacher, okay. what is the correct pronunciation of the of the word comfortable? Comfortable. Comfortable. You know, now that you mentioned, I don't know if I mentioned this to you guys before, but when I was in the States, that was a word that gave me pronunciation problems. <clears throat> and I said it so many times in the wrong way that one day I said, I got it, comfortable. So comfortable is the right uh, pronunciation. Okay. Yes. Any other questions, class? Okay, so, well, this, this is our last class. I want to say thank you again for being patient, for being persistent. Um, an hour every day is not enough. So you should always do something in your free time. If you have someone where you can practice the language with, practice. If you have a cable at home, watch television in English, watch Netflix, YouTube, and all those things. So um, on behalf of Inglés Corporativo, I want to say thank you. And uh, you have my phone number. If in the future you have any questions or comments, feel free to ask. And if I have an answer, I will share it with you. So thank you very much. You guys have a good night. Thank you, teacher. You too, teacher. Yes, sir. Did you? All right. A question. Yes. Uh, we, uh, we will see you again. Uh, I'm not sure because I know I will be... I will be changed to another class, another group. So I don't oh, okay. think uh, we will coincide again, but save my number. You never know. Oh, okay, thank hey, you. Jeff. And yes. when, uh -huh. when, uh, when start the other model? I understand it's going to start this coming Monday if you send the paperwork already, I, I, I think. Uh, so, okay. So it okay, would be good you. if you ask the administration because they have the best answer. Uh, okay. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Edward, you had a question? It's the same, teacher, the same, the Benjamin, because I want to continue the, the another okay, move. Good. So uh, the best thing to do in those cases, ask the administration because they have the best answer. Yep. Okay. 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 All right. All right. Any other questions, class? No. So it was nice working with you. Take care. Have a good night and never stop trying. Good night. Thank okay. you, teacher. Thank you, Thank teacher. You, teacher. Good night. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.